Hi all, welcome back. I hope you're having a happy whatever day you're watching this on or whatever day this is. I don't know, they're all blending into one still. Today I am doing a relax video. We're just going to do a hair video and I know nothing about hair. I'm not a hairstylist. I couldn't really give a damn about my hair on the best of days, but I thought why not? may as well get in and do something with this mop. Um, I have gone to sleep with it wet and God knows what it's going to be like when, he, when I take the hair tie out. Um, I do have very curly wavy hair as it is so when it dries, when it's up and it's wet it's sort of a disaster so we'll see what it's like and then we'll see what we can do with that we'll see how many styles we can get out of it to make it look half decent for the day so as normal this is how i have gotten out of bed it will flop around more than likely as we make this video there are a few bobby pins in there in places i think i'm not sure how many bobby pins are in there we'll find that out as we go uh, but what we're gonna do is first of all what are we gonna do okay I remembered what we were doing first of all we have been sent very kindly this box of goodies from the natural wellness Australia they are a company that make their products from a lot of essential oils. They have a lot of body products, natural spritzes, they've got body rollers, essential oils. Um, they have beautiful, beautiful natural ingredients that they have in them. And they've sent me out a beautiful package. Today I'm going to use, oh, and they're all in really nice beautiful heavy glass bottles as well so beautiful packaging today we're going to use flora water that's 100 percent pure bulgarian rose water and we're also going to use a roller today i think i'll use uh, love today and that has rose orange and patchouli so let's use these two today so thanks to the guys at the Natural Wellness Australia for sending these out. They'll get really good use. So first of all, I'll just give it a little shake. We've just got the little roll-on of the love. That oh, smells so nice. And it comes out more with your natural body heat as well. Okay, so let's give our face a spritz as well. Let's take glasses off, that'll be a good start. This one's really nice and fresh, but really moisturizing as well. <clears throat> Seems really nice. Has no flavor, which is good. So what we're actually going to do before we do the hair is we're going to put contacts in. And then we're going to do the face. I'll rush through the face. We'll get to the hair tutorial. <laughs> and we'll go through there. So let's attempt to pop contact lenses in. And I'll do that off camera because it usually takes me a while. And then we'll come back and do the face. Okay, now that we've got contacts in, I'm still not sure I can see any better. This one's not sitting. 100% hopefully it fixes itself but I'm going to quickly look at my face and then we'll get onto the hair Next 
So, we've done makeup. I put a lash on today, which is very rare, and they actually look half decent, like I got them on pretty well. And they didn't take very long. Which really amazed me, because it's like my contact lenses, anything to do with my eyes usually takes me a while to do. But yeah, I like this. I like everything that turned out today. Okay, so let's attempt the hair now. Sorry, my chair keeps squeezing. Let's see how many bobby pins I can take out. Okay, I think it's just the two. It's already, it's already a mess. Ouch. <laughs> I mean, it's soft and it's healthy, but it's just very crazy hair. So this is what happens when I go to sleep with wet hair. Alright, so let's try some styles. I mean, this doesn't look too bad, but... There are days where it's really bad. So we're going to try some styles and see how we go. Okay, so what are we going to do first? Let's try and part it down the middle. Okay, easy. Go oh, up well. We really need to put a hair mask in, I think, and leave the hair mask overnight and then wash that out. So the first one we're going to do is, I think we'll do a twist down either side and we'll see how that goes. So for that I just grab a little bit at the front and it's like a braid, so you know how you braid, you grab a little bit every time you go back. So that's just what I do with these twists and I just grab that little bit and just we go back and I might stop there. God knows how many bobby pins it's going to take to hold this together. It's cool. I feel like I'm going to go. Okay. One side done. Let's do the other side. For some reason there's so much more hair on this side. Oh, that's chunky. Too bad, right? Let's get rid of these. I know it doesn't look too bad for bad hair. But God knows what the back looks like. We're not even going to look at that. It's just going to be horrendous. It's not too bad for one style. Let's go down to the supermarket in this. Okay, so we're just taking them out. What is, where is that? Okay, so I think we'll do 
Well, there's these face buttons, you know, there's the... They're always an option. Let's attempt... Let's attempt some space buns. These ones don't always go as planned as they usually either... Oh, how long my hair is too. I need longer arms. I need longer arms. These ones usually fall out or I can't get them in the same spot on either side and I just look... Oh, I need longer arms. Okay, maybe that's all right. I just um some little ones for today. One, let's try the other one. Do another sweat. Okay, we got two. And my arm's got to work out as well. Okay. Again, not too bad. We've still got so much excess though. Figure out what to do with all this. usually braid it but I'm not even going to attempt to brush it while it's like this. This is what happens all the time. Natural dreadies. And I'm stuck. <laughs> okay, so we finally got those space bombs out. I think I need a little bit of a chop actually. I think I need a good chop. Who reckons this? Let's use this. This is a wee man. So I know. I know. I'm gonna get the thirteens. One of my fur babies. And Chihuahua. And Chihuahua. I love you. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Good boy. So we could always do one not top knot, like one space one, so a top knot, I guess. These never go as planned. They never look as good as I want them to. My little sister does them really well. They always look good on her. And we'll just cause another mess. And again, who knows what's going on back here. All sorts of craziness going on back there. Hide that. Push that down. Hide that. Oh, my chair is so squeaky. No. Not too bad. I wear it out. Noises due to the messy art bun, which is pretty much what we started with, but you know, a bit better constructed. 
can always do the two big, big top knots. Let's do some big, big top knots. Well, we could try them again. I'm not going to guarantee anything here. Nice and feel like Mickey Mouse afterwards. Holy moly. Holy moly, I'm gonna try the other one into this one. This is going to turn out well. What the hell? Save me, Bobby Pins. This one looks like a little furry. This looks ridiculous. It's sort of cute at the same time. Look good on a toddler. It's comfortable. <laughs> oh god. Ooh, like a three year old. Some bows. Do I have any ribbons? I put some bows in my hair. <laughs> Didn't find any ribbons. <laughs> put a bandana ring instead. You see what skull and cross on that? But again, I can still see a three year old wearing this. would be pretty freaking cute on a three year old. God damn, that's a lot of hair. I really like this bandana. <laughs> now that we've gotten those out, there's only one more hairstyle that we can pretty much do uh, because my hair is a giant bird's, bird's nest. It's just so knotty right now. Is just the messy bum. Messy bum. That's all we can do. And I mean, it's not like it's gonna be hard because it's already a mess. And it's up. And we will all sit down because a bum is so heavy. <laughs> And this is what we're finishing with today because it's this one big bird's nest, one big ball of knots and I can't do anything else with it. It needs a really good hair mask, a soak overnight, <laughs> attempt to brush it tomorrow. But don't forget, you don't always need to look put together. We are in quarantine, so you don't need to put a face on, you don't need to do your hair all the time. If it makes you feel feel better. Like it makes me feel so much better because I don't know about anyone else but this time has just been absolutely horrible, horrible mentally for me. So putting a face on and just playing around with me makes me feel so much better. So if you're at home and you feel like doing your face, even if you're not going anywhere, you feel like doing your hair, curling it, styling it, putting some nice clothes on, do what makes you feel better good stuff anyone else even if you're not going anywhere just do what makes you feel good and don't forget the last option for your hair is don't worry about it just you do you don't worry if it's a mess no one cares so that's it for today guys thanks for watching if you watched the whole thing thank you very much for that if you watched a little bit, if you had it on as background noise, if you accidentally even clicked on here, thank you again. 
feel free to leave a comment, subscribe, leave a like. If you have curly or wavy hair and you have any ideas on how to handle it, uh, feel free to leave a comment below. I'm sure a lot of people would appreciate some suggestions on how to manage really you know, untamable frizzy hair. Um, if you accidentally clicked on here, like this video. If you're breathing, like this video. If you're about to have something to eat, if you're eating while you're watching this, like this video. If you've had a coffee today, like this video. <laughs> but again, thanks for watching guys and we shall see you in the next video where I will hopefully have purple hair because Quarantine is making me insanely crazy bored. And my hair's gonna cop it. See you next video. Bye!